Psalms 16 through 30 of the Book of the Psalms, American Bible Union. This LibriVox recording is in the public domain. Recording by Mark Penfold. Psalms 16 through 30 of the Book of the Psalms, American Bible Union. Psalm 16, Memorial Psalm of David. Preserve me, O God, for I trust in Thee. Thou, my soul, hast said to Jehovah, Thou art Lord. My good is not aside from thee. As for the saints who are in the earth, they are the excellent, in whom is all my delight. Their sorrows shall be multiplied that exchange for another. I will not pour out their drink offerings of blood, and I will not take their names upon my lips. Jehovah is the portion of my heritage and of my cup. Thou wilt maintain my lot. The lines have fallen to me in pleasant places. Yea, I have a goodly heritage. I will bless Jehovah who has counseled me. Also by night my reins admonish me. I have set Jehovah always before me. Because he is on my right hand, I shall not be moved. Therefore my heart is glad, and my glory exults. Also my flesh shall rest in hope. For thou wilt not abandon my soul to the underworld. Thou wilt not suffer thy Holy One to see corruption. Thou wilt show me the path of life, fullness of joys in thy presence, pleasures at thy right hand for evermore. Psalm 17 A Prayer of David Hear, O Jehovah, the right. Be attentive to my cry. Give ear to my prayer from lips not deceitful. Let my sentence come forth from thy presence. Let thine eyes behold the things that are equal. Thou hast tried my heart, hast visited by night, hast assayed me. Thou findest nothing. I have purposed, my mouth shall not transgress. As to the deeds of man, by the word of thy lips I have kept myself from the paths of the violent. My steps have held fast to thy ways, my feet have not wavered. I have called upon thee, for thou wilt answer me, O God, incline thine ear to me, hear my speech. Show thy marvellous kindness, that thou savest the trusting from such as rise up against them with thy right hand. Keep me as the apple of the eye, in the shadow of thy wings thou wilt hide me, from the wicked that oppress me, my deadly enemies that encompass me round. They are enclosed in their own fat, with their mouth they speak proudly. At our footsteps they have now encompassed us, they have set their eyes to bow us down to the earth. He is like a lion that is greedy for prey, and as a young lion lurking in secret places. Arise, O Jehovah, confront him, make him crouch down. Deliver my soul from the wicked, thy sword from men, thy hand, Jehovah, from men of the world whose portion is in life, and with thy hoard thou wilt fill their belly. They shall be surfeited with sons, and leave their excess to their children. As for me, in righteousness shall I behold thy face, shall be satisfied when I awake with thy likeness. Psalm 18 To the Chief Musician By the Servant of Jehovah By David, who spoke to Jehovah the words of this song in the day when Jehovah had delivered him from the hand of all his enemies, and from the hand of Saul. And he said, I will love thee, Jehovah, my strength. Jehovah is my rock and my fortress and my deliverer, my God, my rock. I will trust in him, my shield, my horn of salvation, my high tower. Praised will I call Jehovah, and from my enemies shall I be saved. The bands of death encompassed me, and floods of the ungodly made me afraid. The bands of the underworld surrounded me, the snares of death confronted me. In my distress I called upon Jehovah, and unto my God I cried. From his temple he heard my voice, and my cry came before him into his ears. Then the earth shook and quaked, and the foundations of the mountains trembled, and were shaken, because he was rough. There went up smoke in his nostril, and fire out of his mouth devoured. Coals were kindled from it, and he bowed the heavens and came down, and thick darkness was under his feet. And he rode upon a cherub, and did fly, and soared along on wings of the wind. He made darkness his covering, his pavilion round about him. Dark waters, thick clouds of the skies, from the brightness before him his thick clouds passed away. Hail and coals of fire! And Jehovah thundered in the heavens, and the Most High uttered his voice, Hail and coals of fire! 
and he sent out his arrows and scattered them and shot forth lightnings and discomfited them and the channels of water were seen and the foundations of the world were made bare at thy rebuke o jehovah at the blast of the breath of thy nostrils he sent from on high he took me he drew me out of many waters he delivered me from my strong enemy and from them that hated me for they were too strong for me they confronted me in the day of my calamity and jehovah became a stay for me and brought me forth to a large place and delivered me because he delighted in me jehovah requited me according to my righteousness according to the cleanness of my hands he recompensed me for i have kept the ways of jehovah and have not wickedly departed from my god for all his judgments were before me and his statutes i put not away from me and i was upright with him and kept myself from my iniquity and jehovah recompensed me according to my righteousness according to the cleanness of my hands before his eyes with the gracious thou wilt show thyself gracious with an upright man thou wilt show thyself upright with the pure thou wilt show thyself pure and with the froward thou wilt show thyself froward for thou wilt save an afflicted people and lofty eyes thou wilt bring low for thou wilt light my lamp jehovah my god will enlighten my darkness for by thee i shall run through a troop and by my god i shall leap over a wall as for god his way is perfect the word of jehovah is tried a shield is he to all that trust in him for who is god besides jehovah and who is a rock save our god the mighty that girds me with strength and has made my way perfect making my feet like hinds and on my high places he makes me stand teaching my hands to war and a bow of brass is bent by my arms and thou gavest me the shield of thy salvation and thy right hand will hold me up and thy condescension will make me great thou wilt enlarge my steps under me and my ankles waver not i shall pursue my enemies and overtake them and shall not turn again till they are consumed i shall smite them and they will not be able to rise they will fall beneath my feet for thou hast girded me with strength for the battle thou wilt make them crouch under me that rise up against me and thou hast given me the neck of my enemies and those that hate me i will destroy them they will cry and there is no deliverer to jehovah and he answers them not and i shall beat them small as dust before the wind as mire of the streets i will pour them out thou wilt deliver me from the strifes of the people thou wilt make me the head of the heathen a people i have not known shall serve me at the hearing of the ear they will obey me strangers will profess submission to me strangers will fade away and will tremble from their strongholds jehovah lives and blessed be my rock and let the god of my salvation be exalted the mighty who avenges me and has subdued peoples under me delivering me from my enemies yea thou wilt lift me above those that rise up against me from the man of violence thou wilt rescue me therefore i will praise thee jehovah among the heathen and to thy name will i sing great deliverances he gives to his king and shows kindness to his anointed to david and to his seed for evermore psalm nineteen to the chief musician a psalm of david the heavens declare the glory of god and the expanse proclaims his handiwork day to day utters speech and night to night shows knowledge there is no speech nor language where their voice is not heard their line is gone out through all the earth and their words to the end of the world in them has he set a tabernacle for the sun and he is as a bridegroom coming out of his chamber he rejoices as a strong man to run a race his going forth is from the end of the heavens and his circuit unto the ends thereof and there is nothing hidden from his heat the law of jehovah is perfect converting the soul the testimony of jehovah is sure making wise the simple the precepts of jehovah are right rejoicing the heart the commandment of jehovah is pure enlightening the eyes the fear of jehovah is clean enduring for ever the judgments of jehovah are truth they are righteous altogether more to be desired than gold and much fine gold and sweeter than honey and the dropping of the combs moreover by them is thy servant warned in keeping them there is great reward errors who can understand of hidden ones do thou acquit me 
also from presumptuous ones withhold thy servant let them not have dominion over me then shall i be upright and be free from great transgression let the words of my mouth and meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight jehovah my rock and my redeemer psalm twenty to the chief musician a psalm of david jehovah answer thee in the day of trouble the name of the god of jacob defend thee send thee help from the sanctuary and strengthen thee from zion remember all thy offerings and accept thy burnt sacrifice grant thee according to thy heart and fulfil all thy counsel may we shout for joy in thy deliverance and in the name of our god lift up a banner jehovah fulfil all thy petitions now know i that jehovah saves his anointed he will answer him from his holy heavens with the saving strength of his right hand some in chariots and some in horses but we in the name of jehovah our god will glory they have bowed down and fallen but we are risen and stand upright jehovah save let the king answer us in the day we call psalm twenty one to the chief musician a psalm of david jehovah in thy strength shall the king rejoice and in thy salvation how greatly shall he exult thou hast given him his heart's desire and hast not withholden the request of his lips pause for thou dost anticipate him with blessings of goodness thou settest a crown of pure gold on his head he asked of thee life and thou gavest it to him length of days for ever and ever great is his glory in thy salvation honour and majesty thou dost lay upon him for thou makest him a blessing for ever thou dost gladden him with joy by thy countenance for the king trusts in jehovah and through the kindness of the most high he shall not be moved thy hand will find out all thy enemies thy right hand will find out those that hate thee thou wilt make them as a fiery furnace in the time of thine anger jehovah will swallow them up in his wrath and fire will devour them their fruit thou wilt destroy from the earth and their seed from the sons of men for they spread out evil against thee they devised a plot they shall not prevail for thou wilt make them turn their back with thy bowstrings thou wilt aim against their face exalt thyself jehovah in thy strength we will sing and praise in song thy power psalm twenty two to the chief musician after the melody hind of the morning a psalm of david my god my god why hast thou forsaken me far from my deliverance are the words of my groaning my god i cry in the daytime and thou answerest not and in the night season and there is no quiet for me but thou art holy enthroned in the praises of israel in thee our fathers trusted they trusted and thou didst deliver them to thee they cried and were freed in thee they trusted and were not ashamed but i am a worm and not a man a reproach of men and despised of the people all that see me mock at me they thrust out the lip they shake the head saying commit it to jehovah he will deliver him he will rescue him for he delights in him but thou art he that took me out of the womb that made me trust when on my mother's breasts on thee was i cast from the womb from the bowels of my mother thou art my god be not far from me for trouble is near for there is no helper many bulls have encompassed me strong ones of bashan have beset me round they gaped upon me with their mouth a ravening and roaring lion i am poured out like water and all my bones are parted my heart is become like wax melted in the midst of my bowels my strength is dried up like a potsherd and my tongue cleaves to my jaws and thou wilt lay me in the dust of death for dogs have encompassed me the assembly of evil-doers have enclosed me piercing my hands and my feet i may number all my bones they look they stare upon me they part my garments among them and for my vesture they cast lots but thou jehovah be not afar off o oh, my strength hasten to my help rescue my soul from the sword my life from the power of the dog 
save me from the lion's mouth and answer and rescue me from the horns of wild oxen i will declare thy name to my brethren in the midst of the assembly will i praise thee ye that fear jehovah praise him all ye seed of jacob glorify him and fear him all ye seed of israel for he is not despised nor abhorred the affliction of the afflicted and he has not hid his face from him and when he cried to him he heard of thee shall be my praise in the great congregation my vows i will pay before them that fear him the humble shall eat and shall be satisfied they will praise jehovah that seek him may your heart live for ever all the ends of the earth shall remember and turn to jehovah and all the families of nations shall worship before thee for the kingdom is jehovah's and he is ruler among the nations they eat and worship all the rich of the earth before him shall bow all that go down to the dust and he that cannot keep his soul alive a seed shall serve him it shall be told of the lord for generations they shall come and shall make known his righteousness to a people that shall be born that he has done it psalm twenty three a psalm of david jehovah is my shepherd i shall not want he makes me lie down in green pastures he leads me beside the still waters he restores my soul he guides me in paths of righteousness for his name's sake yea though i walk through the valley of the shadow of death i will fear no evil for thou art with me thy rod and thy staff they comfort me thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my adversaries thou anointest my head with oil my cup runs over surely goodness and mercy will follow me all the days of my life and i shall dwell in the house of jehovah for ever psalm twenty four a psalm of david the earth is jehovah's and the fullness thereof the world and they that dwell therein for he founded it upon the seas and established it upon the floods who shall ascend into the mount of jehovah and who shall stand in his holy place he that has clean hands and a pure heart who has not lifted up his soul to vanity and has not sworn deceitfully he shall receive a blessing from jehovah and righteousness from the god of his salvation this is the generation of them that seek him that seek thy face even jacob pause lift up your heads ye gates and lift yourselves up ye everlasting doors that the king of glory may come in who is this the king of glory jehovah strong and mighty jehovah mighty in battle lift up your heads ye gates and lift up ye everlasting doors that the king of glory may come in who then is he the king of glory jehovah of hosts he is the king of glory pause psalm twenty five a psalm of david to thee o jehovah i will lift up my soul my god in thee do i trust let me not be ashamed let not my enemies triumph over me yea let none that wait for thee be ashamed let them be ashamed that transgress without cause make me know thy ways o jehovah teach me thy paths make me walk in thy truth and teach me for thou art the god of my salvation on thee i wait all the day remember thy tender mercies o jehovah and thy kindnesses for they have been of old the sins of my youth and my trespasses do not remember according to thy kindness remember thou me for thy goodness sake o jehovah good and upright is jehovah therefore will he direct sinners in the way he will guide the humble in that which is right and the humble he will teach his way all the paths of jehovah are kindness and truth to such as keep his covenant and his testimonies for thy name's sake o jehovah thou wilt pardon my iniquity for it is great what man is he that fears jehovah him will he instruct in the way he should choose his soul shall dwell at ease and his seed shall possess the land the secret of jehovah is for them that fear him and he makes them know his covenant mine eyes are ever toward jehovah for he will bring out my feet from the net turn unto me and be gracious to me for i am desolate and afflicted 
the troubles of my heart are enlarged bring thou me out of my distresses look on my affliction and my pain and forgive all my sins behold my enemies that they are many and hate me with cruel hatred keep my soul and rescue me let me not be ashamed for i have trusted in thee let integrity and uprightness preserve me for i wait on thee redeem israel o god out of all his troubles psalm twenty six a psalm of david judge me o jehovah for i have walked in my integrity and in jehovah have i trusted i shall not waver try me o jehovah and test me assay my reins and my heart for thy loving kindness is before my eyes and i have walked in thy truth i have not sat with men of falsehood and i will not go in with dissemblers i have hated the congregation of evildoers and i will not sit with the wicked i will wash my hands in innocency and will encompass thine altar o jehovah that i may publish with the voice of thanksgiving and recount all thy wondrous works jehovah i have loved the habitation of thy house and the place where thy glory dwells gather not my soul with sinners nor my life with bloody men in whose hands is mischief and their right hand is full of bribes but as for me i will walk in my integrity redeem me and be gracious to me my foot stands in an even place in the congregations will i bless jehovah psalm twenty seven a psalm of david jehovah is my light and my salvation of whom shall i be afraid jehovah is the stronghold of my life of whom shall i be in dread when the wicked came upon me to eat up my flesh my foes and my enemies it was they that stumbled and fell if a host shall encamp against me my heart will not fear if war shall rise up against me in this will i be confident one thing have i asked of jehovah that will i seek after that i may dwell in the house of jehovah all the days of my life to behold the beauty of jehovah and to inquire in his temple for in the day of evil he will hide me in his pavilion he will conceal me in the covert of his tabernacle he will set me on high upon a rock and now shall my head be high above my enemies round about me and i will offer in his tabernacle sacrifices of triumph i will sing and will praise jehovah in song hear o jehovah my voice i cry and do thou be gracious to me and answer me my heart has said to thee seek ye my face thy face jehovah will i seek hide not thy face from me turn not thy servant away in anger thou hast been my help cast me not off and forsake me not o god of my salvation when my father and my mother have forsaken me then jehovah will receive me teach me thy way o jehovah lead me in a plain path because of my enemies give me not up to the will of my foes for false witnesses have risen up against me and such as breathe out violence had i not believed that i should see the goodness of jehovah in the land of the living wait on jehovah be of good courage and let thy heart be strong and wait on jehovah psalm twenty eight a psalm of david unto thee jehovah will i call my rock be not deaf to me lest thou be silent to me and i become like them that go down to the pit hear the voice of my supplications when i cry to thee for help when i lift up my hands toward thy holy oracle draw me not away with the wicked and with workers of iniquity who speak peace with their neighbors and mischief is in their heart give them according to their doing and according to the evil of their deeds give them according to the work of their hands render to them their desert because they regard not the works of jehovah nor the labor of his hands he will destroy them and not build them up blessed be jehovah because he has heard the voice of my supplications jehovah is my strength and my shield in him my heart trusted and i was helped and my heart shall triumph and with my song will i praise him jehovah is strength to them and a stronghold of salvation is he to his anointed save thy people and bless thy heritage and feed them and bear them up for ever psalm twenty nine a psalm of david 
give to jehovah ye sons of god give to jehovah glory and strength give to jehovah the glory of his name worship jehovah in the beauty of holiness the voice of jehovah is on the waters the god of glory thunders jehovah is on the great waters the voice of jehovah is mighty the voice of jehovah is full of majesty the voice of jehovah breaks the cedars and jehovah breaks the cedars of lebanon and he makes them skip like a calf lebanon and syrian like the young of the wild ox the voice of jehovah cleaves out flames of fire the voice of jehovah shakes the wilderness jehovah shakes the wilderness of kadesh the voice of jehovah makes the hinds bring forth and lays bare the forests and in his palace they all say glory jehovah sat in judgment at the flood and jehovah sits a king for ever jehovah will give strength to his people jehovah will bless his people with peace psalm thirty a psalm a song for the dedication of the house of david i will extol thee jehovah for thou hast delivered me and hast not made my enemies rejoice over me jehovah my god i cried to thee for help and thou didst heal me jehovah thou hast brought up my soul from the underworld thou hast kept me alive that i should not go down to the pit sing praise to jehovah ye his saints and give praise to his holy memorial for his anger is for a moment in his favor is life weeping may endure for a night but in the morning there is joy and as for me in my prosperity i said i shall never be moved jehovah by thy favor thou madest my mountain stand strong thou didst hide my face i was troubled to thee jehovah i call and to jehovah i make supplication what profit is there in my blood when i go down to the pit will dust praise thee will it declare thy truth hear o jehovah and be gracious to me jehovah be thou my helper thou hast turned for me my mourning into dancing thou hast loosed my sackcloth and girded me with gladness in order that my glory may sing praise to thee and not be silent jehovah my god i will give thanks to thee for ever the end of psalms sixteen through thirty recording by mark penfold